Okay, we got a 2020 Nissan Rogue. Customer says the truck needs front wheel bearings. So, we're going to get into this job and I'm going to give you accurate, fully detailed video as I always do. You know, the proper sizes for each bolt to remove. Not just going to do a video. We're going to let you know what you need and how you can get this done efficiently and smoothly. So now we're going to remove the tire. To remove the tire is a 21 millimeter to remove the lugs. You know what I'm using? Favorite tool, best brand I use. So we're going to remove the lugs. 21. Okay, lugs are off. Tire off. Okay. All right. Okay. So for that hub nut, as you can see, they got a cover with a carter pin. We're gonna get that off. Now you gotta take the pass off, so we're gonna get into the job. Okay. We're gonna spray everything down. As we're gonna we're gonna grow with this Hercules today. You know I kinda like that gun, it's pretty durable. We're gonna roll with that. Hold on, I gotta readjust my camera, people. Okay, to take off the caliber. That is a 14 millimeter. To remove the caliber. Rest the caliber right there. Move the pads. And me personally, when you doing a job like this, just replace the pads. It's, you know, you already in the job. Just put some new pads on it. Okay, let's get that carter pin out. You're pretty strong now. Okay, Carter pan out. Gotta get these up. It's paint. That paint on. That on. So she slide on. I really don't see the point of this, but I guess it's some some factory stuff. Cause if the nut come loose, this little piece not gonna stop nothing. Okay. Let me get a screwdriver. Okay. Get another screw. Pop him back. Out of there. Okay. Now. 
I like to break that loose now and then we'll proceed to remove the caliber bracket. So let me see what size nut that is and uh, we can get that out. Okay, the proper size to this, 32 millimeter. Put it on my Milwaukee. Let's get her out of there. Okay, like butter. Okay, we're gonna use this on here so you don't booger up them threads. We're gonna tap that axle out to break it free from the hood. Let me get my sludge. Okay, I'm back. Okay. See, she moved, she out of there. Now you can take your nut all the way off. See? She free. Move it with your hand. Now I need to cut the wheel so we can get this caliber bracket off, get this rotor off, we can get into the job. Okay. The caliber bracket size is 19. Put it on just like this. She out of there. Okay. Got our rotor. Okay. Take our spray. Put something on them threads. Okay. Okay, now here's the tricky part. Into them screws that's in here. Okay, that's why I slid the axle back. Okay, let's see what size those are. Okay. Okay, proper size to the hub bearing. Those hub bearing nuts are a 17 on a 3 8 drive though. Can't use no half inch, it's tight in there. Let's see if we can get her out. Okay. We need some leverage. Okay, got a breaker bar, three eighths. They come out now. Easy. Okay. Let's get in there. Easy. Okay. Now we take this. You want to be quick. Too much extension. Just pull them out. They out of there. Out. Remember, they are seventeen millimeters. Okay. Now I got to get and turn the wheel. Okay, we're on the back side. Woo! She kind of tight. Flip 
put a lot of, put a lot more leverage. <clears throat> okay, broke loose. Uh, we get there. Okay, they broke. Now, take your gun. Get on in there. Hercules, Hercules. Okay, they out of there. Okay. Okay. But remember, you got an ABS sensor right here. Put some spray on it. Y'all don't wanna. Y'all don't wanna break the screw. That's a 10 millimeter. Okay, let me go get my 10. We can get that out of there. Okay, that's a 10 millimeter for the ABS sensor. We're gonna put Hercules on it. She out. Okay. And the screwdriver. You want to pry that out. You do not want to break that. Okay. Put a little spray on in there. So you know it breaks free. Okay. Slide out easy with that spray. Okay, see? Always spray it. Okay? Now we're gonna get the hub off. Just tap it off. Put some spray around his backside. Now she on there pretty tough, people. So it's gonna take a little muscle to get it off. But we're gonna get it off. Okay. You don't need none of that fancy pullers and all that. You can just pop him off. Okay, she out of there. Okay, she out, as you can see. I get her off the heat shield, that's easy. Right. Wiggle it out. She out of there. Okay, let's get the new hood. Let's get it back together. Okay, here is the part number. As you can see, DL513357, Duralast. Okay. You know we're gonna do our match test. Same bad boy. Put our shield back on. Mm Sure your shield go that way because you gotta have this open for your your mountain. Okay. Let's get that axle in, people. Woo! 
We gonna sop it, so we gonna grease her up. We need that slab, baby. The slide right on. See? Always grease it. Some spray, something. Anything. Okay. Set my caliber right there. She ain't going nowhere. Okay. Make sure everything lined up. Let's get a screw. Let's get a screw in there. Tap it on. It's the tab. Don't hit this hard. Just tap it in. Okay, make sure everything lined up. Lightly tap, now let's get our screws in here. Let's get them lined up. Got a screw. Okay, I like to do a crisscross pattern when I'm installing the screws. Okay, all the screws. Let's get them started. We're just gonna bump them in. Okay, see she coming through? Maybe we lined up good. Okay. Let me cut the wheel. Okay, we got the wheel cut. Now, let's get these. Okay, that's caught. Okay, so they all caught. Okay. Got to turn the wheel again. Okay, I'm just going to run them now. They all lined up. Okay. Now, don't trust that to get them tight. Always do a manual check. <clears throat> All right. Always do a manual check on these, please. I don't trust it. to be safe. Okay. Tight.
Okay. Let's get these on this back side. Okay. Let's get a little tight. 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 All right. Okay, people, that's on. You can go ahead and let's get the rotor slap back on. Get the bracket back on while we got the wheel cocked. Let's get the bracket back. We got it down. Okay. And once again, we're dealing with wheels, brakes. Do your manual check. Mm, that's on there. on there okay customer got new brakes so we're gonna get them installed might have to heat that up if that ain't moving okay let's get the brakes okay we got the brakes Detroit axle premium brake pads uh, $36, not bad. They like to give you new hardware, but I, I like the factory hardware, to be honest with you. Just uh, be sure to lube it up. And you'll be good to go. Let your contact points here, here, and there. Put some grease on all contact points and there. And there, I mean, I, I don't give you enough. I got some more, but that's what you do. Grease your contact points. Slip your pads in. Back one always tricky. Okay. 
Okay, let's see in. Let's get the caliber ready. Okay, so you get your C clamp. So you can compress the caliber because we are installing new pads. Turn it slow. See how it move in? Just turn it slow. Turn it slow. She go right in. That's it. Done dilly. Yep, it's good. Okay. Some grease. These are contact points as well. Let's get something on that. Okay. Let's get her set down. Slid right on. Okay. Screw. Here. Here. Remember, 14 millimeter on the Hercules. Kind of got us to get them started. Get this situated. Gotta make sure that's lined up. It's in the groove. Okay. Okay. Now you know I'ma do my, always do your double check by hand. Don't always trust your cordless stuff. Good. Good. Mm, Hercules got some strength. Okay. Now, we're going to put our nut on for the axle. Now we're getting the car and straighten up the wheel. Because you don't want to tighten that nut up and the axle cock. Okay, remember, 32. Okay, you know she hit hard. Put that on. Just knock down some of them teeth. It's your Carter pin. Take your hammer. Tap it down. And that's that, people. Hub bearing, front brake pads. So that's the complete job. And um, all the right size tools you need to use. I hate seeing videos. You don't tell me the size, the sockets. Don't show me the technique, nothing. But you know, that's why you came the same day. So now we'll install. Remember, you got to install the ABS. Put your ABS in. Okay. 
Then I'm gonna put some spray in there. Get that sensor back in there. Okay. 10 millimeter here. Two millimeter on the Hercules. A1. Put the tire back on, she good. Double check, on, on, sensor, hub. Here go the old hub. She done, if you can hear it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that's it. That concludes the video. And I uh, hope this helped you get the job done quick, safely, and efficiently.